dear friends we are celebrating easter for the second time after the outbreak of corona pandemic even after one year of difficulties caused by this pandemic it shows no decline many countries have reported second or third wave the governments are forced to make strict measures affecting the normal life of the people and naturally the faith life of the people are also affected people are compelled especially the sick and the elderly to remain in their house out of fear of this sickness we live in the midst of uncertainties fear and despair our feelings are similar to the feelings of the disciples of jesus after the good friday after the, the death of jesus the disciples also had high expectations of jesus as someone who would redeem them from roman occupation and establish a glorious israel all their dreams were scattered when jesus died and we can see that in the conversation of the two disciples who went to emmaus dear friends in the gospel today we see the attitude of mary magdalene and the rest of the disciples when they heard the news about jesus resurrection they came to faith in the resurrection gra- gradually they could not believe it immediately a progression from fear to doubt from evidence to faith mary magdalene's faith like the uh, rest of the disciples was not extinguished it was only eclipsed the light was still there but it was covered dear friends it is also very significant to note that the first witnesses of the resurrection of christ were believing women and among the jews at the time of jesus uh, it was the testimony of women was not held uh, in high regard and still jesus chose women as witnesses of his resurrection the reaction of the disciples when they uh, heard the news also affirms the doubt in their minds they could not believe the words of women however when they reached the tomb they saw that the clothes were carefully folded and we could think what kind of faith did peter and john have at the stage at that stage in their spiritual experience they had a faith based on evidence the truth of easter does not depend on empty tomb any longer for our generation rather faith in the word of god is now our evidence we have to find hope in the words of jesus to thomas blessed are those who have not seen and yet have come to believe as we read in john's gospel chapter 20 verse 29 faith is like a bright ray of sunlight it enables us to see god in all things as well as all things in god says saint francis de sales dear friends 
as an Easter people, let us proclaim the resurrected Christ, knowing that he has brought forth life from death, light from darkness, and a hope from despair. As St. John Paul II says, do not abandon yourselves to despair. We are the Easter people, and Hallelujah is our song. Dear friends, in these days, we are all concerned about how the virus affects our bodies. Our world is taking all the precautions to control the virus from spreading. Vaccines are developed or still developing to protect us from the virus. Nevertheless, we also need to examine how the virus, how the coronavirus has affected our souls. Can the celebration of the resurrection give new life to our spiritual life? May God bless you with abundant faith, serenity and joy in this Easter. Dear friends, be sharers of the word of God. Message of hope like Mary Magdalene by sharing this video to one or two of your friends. I wish you a blessed and happy Easter.